Newcastle 1720 Gloucester, visitors hold on to third and table with win. Gloucester hung on to third place in the Gallagher Premiership with a hard-fought 2017 win over rock-bottom Newcastle at Kingston Park. In front of their biggest crowd of the season, 9,024, the Falcons came back from 10-6 down at half-time to lead 17-10 heading into the final quarter of the match. However, a close-range try from England No. 8 Ben Morgan converted by Billy 12 trees leveled the scores, and then with 7 minutes to go 12 trees slotted over the match-winning penalty to keep Gloucester in the hunt for a play-off spot. The visitors led by 4 points at the interval thanks to a try from skipper Red Slater, which came after a controversial penalty awarded by a referee Carl Dixon following a mass brawl just before half-time. Prior to that, Newcastle had looked relatively comfortable with their 6-3 lead, thanks to two sone attentacula penalties in response to 12 Dree's early three-pointer for the visitors. Gloucester started well and were rewarded by 12 Dree's fifth-minute penalty. Newcastle responded and a Toby Flood kick to the corner looked like yielding a try, but the Gloucester pack were superb in forcing them all into touch. However, Newcastle turned the line out over, won a penalty and Taku leveled the scores. Another Taku penalty gave the hosts a 29th minute lead following a double mistake by Morgan, who knocked on from Josh Matevezi's long kick and then straight offside. Newcastle looked set to take that advantage into the interval but that changed just before half-time when there was a full-scale brawl involving both sets of forwards. After consulting his TMO and touch judges, referee Dixon gave a penalty against Tevita Cavabati, who had reacted to what seemed to be a Gloucester hand in the face of Gary Graham following a scuffle between him and Tom Hudson. The Falcons were clearly unhappy, as were the Newcastle fans and their mood did not improve as Gloucester kicked to the corner and eventually drove Slater over for a try under the posts, with 12 trees adding the extras. It clearly fired up Newcastle who took just 90 seconds into the second half to hit back as Nicky Gonva crossed for a try. Simon Hammersley collected Callum Brally's kick and released Tackle who put Gonva over from 40 meters to make it 11-10. Newcastle were unhappy again after Takula was tackled off the ball following a 50-meter gallop by Proplanga v. E. Mulipala. And they could not have been too pleased when the referee played only a very short advantage as they hammered up to the Gloucester line, leaving the hosts having to settle for another Takula penalty in the 51st minute. The Tongan halfback kicked his fourth penalty six minutes later to make it 17-10 as Gloucester found it hard to contain Newcastle's drive into their half. But then the Cherry and Whites hit back with a sustained attack of their own and Morgan was driven over from close range. 12 Trees conversion leveled the score at 17-17 with 18 minutes left on the clock. Newcastle were clearly under pressure in the scrum and Gloucester looked very much in control in the closing 10 minutes and a 73-yard minute penalty from 12 Trees edged them in from 2017. It proved the game's crucial score with Newcastle unable to find a way through the Gloucester defence as they pushed hard late on.